Hello students, welcome to Saurav Sir's classes. Today we are going to solve few numericals based on SAT examination. So let us begin with our very first question. So our first question says the area of triangle ADC is equal to 80. So here you can see the triangle ADC. So this ADC triangle has an area of 18. Now BC by DC is equal to 3 by 2. So here we have our BC and divided by we have DC. So this is DC is equal to 3 by 2. Now what is the area of triangle ABD? So we need to find the area of this triangle. So let us begin with our given data first which is BC by DC is equal to 3 by 2. Here we have BC by DC is equal to 3 by 2. So here you can see in BC this one from B to C we can say that it is BD plus DC. So here we can write BD plus DC whole divided by DC is equal to 3 by 2. Now cross multiplying 2BD plus 2DC is equal to 3DC. Therefore we have DC is equal to twice of BD. So we can say that BD is half of DC. So here we have got our relation between DC and BD. Now we have one more data which is triangle ADC is equal to 18. Area of triangle ADC is equal to 18. So this is area of triangle ADC is equal to 18. First let us draw this triangle in a simpler way. Since this triangle is inverted we can take the BC as our base because we have BC common in both the triangles. We have common we have triangle ADC and ABD. We have only BC as the common part. So we will draw our triangle in this manner. This will be BC. This is BA and here we will have AC. So this is the triangle. We have AD here and let us draw a height perpendicular to BC. So this is BC. This is D. This is C and let this be Okay, so this is A. Yeah, so let this be E. The height is E. And you can see that this height is common to both the triangles. Triangle ADC and triangle ABD. Both the triangles have the height H. So we can proceed in the same manner. So this triangle, area of triangle ADC. So here you can see triangle ADC. So this is the triangle ADC. So in this triangle, uh, area will be half into height let height be h into dc the base is dc so this is dc is equal to 18 so from here we can get dc is equal to 36 by h so we have got our value to dc and from this statement here we have dc equal to 3 to bd we can get the value of bd also so dc is 36 by h so 36 by h is equal to 2 bd so from this we get BD is equal to 18 by H. Now we have got BD in terms of height. Now we can directly find the area of the triangle ABD. So in triangle ABD. So here you can see triangle ABD. This is the total triangle. This is the required area triangle ABD where height is H and the base is BD. So this will be area will be equal to half into height is h area is bd so we can now replace bd as we have got the value of bd here you can see bd is equal to 18 by h so this is 18 by h h gets cancelled out 2 gets cancelled out with 18 and we are left with 9 so 9 square units is the answer to this question that is area of triangle abd that is the required question so our answer will be 9 square units let's move on to the next question that is question number 2 so question 2 says if the angle not shown in the figure created by the intersection of two lines M and N. Okay so here we have M and N. So they are moving here. They will obviously meet at some point. He let they intersect here because these two are departing from each other. So these two will meet at some point. And the same as the angle created by the lines of in, uh, intersection of the lines L and N. K. So these, this is L and here we have K. So these two are going to intersect somewhere here 
and we have been said that this angle is equal to this angle now what is the value of x so here we have x and we have been given two degrees 180 and 80 so uh, 120 and 80 so here is so this was basically our question let us draw another diagram so let me draw another diagram here we have the k this one is k and let this be m this is the extended version the extended form of each of the line this is n so let me make them intersecting somewhere so they will intersect somewhere far from the line now the fourth line is l so it will be like this and we need to extend the line k also so that they intersect each other so here we have all the four lines extended this line is k this line is m uh, sorry l this is m and this is n now we have been given this is and degree x degrees here we have 120 degrees and here we have 80 degrees and we have been said that this degree and this angle both angles are same so let us assume we have x already in the question so let us assume this angles to be y degree so these two are equal that is y degree so in this diagram you can see that here we have 120 degrees therefore we can find this angle so just a second so here we this is 120 degree let me denote it by red yeah so here we have 120 degree therefore this angle will be 180 minus 120 that is 60 degrees and here also we can find this angle because we have 80 here and 180 minus 80 gives us 100 degrees so these two are 60 and 100 so here we can find the value of x because we have a triangle here this one is a triangle and the interior angle sum up to 180 degree so in this triangle we have 60 degrees plus 100 degrees plus y equal to 180 so from this we can say that y is equal to 20 degrees so since we have been given that this angle is also equal to that angle therefore here also this will be 20 degrees so let us write this here as 20 degrees so this is 20 degree here we have been given x and here you can see we have been given 120 so assuming this triangle let me remove this part so we can assume this part not to be there now we have basically a triangle here with all three angles this one is x here we have 120 and here we have 20 so these three will sum up to 180 so 120 plus 20 plus x is equal to 180 therefore from this we can say that sorry not y but this will be x so x is equal to 180 minus 140 which gives 40 degrees so our answer to this question will be 40 degree because we needed what is the value of x therefore x value is 40 degrees so this question is also completed now i will like to end this video here you will find solutions to few more questions based on the same topic in our further videos